you're out diving and you take a picture of that loggerhead, we can bring it back into our lab and find out what year we had it in there and it tells us how old it is. Yes, and when she does, she eventually is going to turn around. So, I, sorry we didn't get to see her drop eggs, but you know, that's nature, yep. <laughs> right? Yeah. We got to see a turtle, and that's the most important thing. Yeah. You are in the sand splash. So now she's going to start spraying a little bit. <laughs> Do they come back and like to lay in the same area? Yes, yeah, they come back. She'll come back in the, gen in the general area. Maybe, maybe in a couple of weeks it'll be just beyond those rocks up in Highland Beach, mm -hmm. or a couple of weeks it might be down in uh, Red Reef Park. But definitely same vicinity, same vicinity for sure. Yeah, looking, oh, Some species are more site specific than others. Uh, leatherbacks These, are not oh, as site specific. The ones we're going to release tonight? No, we're going to release them after this. Yeah, this bucket. Yeah, we're releasing these turtles tonight after after we see this loggerhead go back to this ocean. They'll be ready to go back in the ocean. And of course, her eggs are going to hatch about 55 yeah. days from now. Now, those people's lights on in the condo, does that bother them? Yeah, well, it won't bother her, but there's a chance that when the hatchlings emerge two months from now, that lights like that, yes, could cause them to crawl in the opposite direction of the ocean for sure. So Turtle, David. 